Do you need help pointing your domain to WP Engine using A records? We're here to help. Correctly pointing your domain is an important step of the go live process because it's what allows traffic to be sent through your domain to your website on WP Engine. It also enables WP Engine to order a free SSL certificate for you and automatically apply it to your website. SSL ensures visitors can connect to your website securely and keeps your content from being blocked by major web browsers. Before we get started, I want to mention that during this tutorial, you will need to log in to your domain provider account. We don't sell domain names here at WP Engine, so this will be a separate provider. If you're not sure who your domain provider is, you can use the Whois Lookup tool at whois.com slash whois to find out. Simply enter your domain name, click search, and then you'll see your provider listed at the top of the page under Registrar. Also, depending on who your domain provider is, WP Engine may be able to automatically point your domain name for you. This means that if you purchase your domain from a supported provider and you'd like for us to automatically connect your domain, you can skip this tutorial and use that method instead. Now, let's talk about what A records are. A records are a type of DNS record or domain name system record that points domain names to IP addresses. The A stands for address. An IP address is a unique numeric label assigned to a website or server. For example, a server's IP address could be something like 142.193.2.2.2. The IP address is considered to be the official address of that server. However, because it's not easy to remember strings of numbers that make up IP addresses, and because IP addresses sometimes need to change, we need to use human-readable names for websites. In other words, domain names. So, you can use A records to point your domain name to an IP address so people can find your website easily. The method I'm about to show you involves using two different A records to point your root or Apex domain to two different IP addresses. Doing it this way allows your domain to take full advantage of the cloud load balancing that our high performance networks provide. The first step is to log into the user portal and click sites in the primary menu on the left. Next, click the site name you want to work on. Then. Click Domains in the secondary menu on the left. If you haven't done so already, you need to add your domain name to the user portal before you can point your domain. For now, we'll assume that you've already added your domain. Find the domain you're working on and click the three dot menu next to it. Select View DNS Details. And here, you'll see two A records listed. Keep this tab open so you can come back and copy them in a few minutes. Now, Open a new tab, log into your domain provider account, and find the DNS editor. In this example, I'm using Namecheap, so I need to go to the Advanced DNS page. If you're not sure where your DNS editor is, you can ask your domain provider. Once you're in the DNS editor, check to see if there's an existing A record for the root domain. If it exists, this record will be named something like mywebsite.com or it will be using the at symbol, and it will be pointed to an IP address. If you do see this record, go back to the tab with your WP Engine DNS details and click the copy icon next to the first IP address. Then come back to the DNS editor, select the edit option, and change the value of that existing record to the first WP Engine IP address. Click Save when you're finished. Be careful about modifying or deleting any other records that already exist, especially MX records, which are responsible for email. If you don't see this existing A record, you'll need to create it. And here's how. Create a new record and enter the following information. Type A. Host, at symbol, or yourdomain.com. Type your domain name without the www prefix. Value, paste the first IP address from WP Engine. 
TTL automatic. When you're finished, click Save. Now you're ready to set up the second A record. Go back to the tab with your WP Engine DNS details and click the copy icon next to the second IP address. Then come back to the DNS editor, create a new record, and enter the following information. Type A. Host at symbol or yourdomain.com. Type your domain name without the www prefix. Value, paste the second IP address from WP Engine. TTL, automatic. And when you're finished, click Save. There's one more step we need to complete, and that is to set up a www record. This allows anyone who types your domain name with the www prefix, like www.mywebsite.com, to find your website. Since the www record is technically considered a subdomain, we need to point it to WP Engine using a CNAME record instead of an A record. Here's how you do it. In your DNS editor, create a new record and enter the following information. Type CNAME. Host www. Value yourdomain.com. Type your domain name without the www prefix. TTL automatic. When you're finished, click Save. Now you just need to wait for the DNS changes to propagate. Propagation is the automatic process of updating servers across the world to the new DNS information and can take anywhere from a few minutes up to 48 hours. We can't predict exactly how long propagation will take because it all depends on how long it takes each of those servers to update their caches with the new information. This is not something WP Engine has control of. But you can check the status of your domain's propagation at whatsmydns.net. Enter your domain name, select A, and then click Search. When you see all green check marks instead of red X's in the list, your domain propagation is complete. You can also check the status of your DNS on the Domains page in the User Portal. If you see a green check mark here, your DNS is correctly pointed to WP Engine. Once propagation is complete, your website will be officially live on WP Engine, and anyone who visits your domain will be directed to your WP Engine-powered website. If you have any questions or need additional assistance, check out our support center at my.wpengine.com support. You can also get to this page under Get Help. This is where you can search our help documentation and find other helpful resources. You can also reach out to our friendly support team. We're always here and ready to help.